Design process by example. Thumbnails, roughs, and comps. Thumbnail layouts are quick sketches used to explore many layout ideas that a designer may have about a project. They're loose sketches, they're not detailed, and they only suggest general direction, hierarchy, and how the layout will look. The images should be sketched in a scaled down proportion of the finished format size. And designers usually work up many thumbnail sketches before they select one to pursue at full size. Rough layouts are the second step in the design process and they are prepared from a thumbnail concept. So keeping the thread of the concept moving forward and developing as you go, you're showing size and space relationships between text, also called copy, and white space as well as other elements in the layout. The major elements and their placements are indicated with detail so that you can tell direction, balance, weight, flow, and the overall unity of the design as it's being established. Photos and imagery have direction and weight and they can be used as pointing devices. So it's important to give enough detail in any image or photo that you're using so that we can see what's happening with those images in relation to the other elements in the layout. Any logos in the layout should be indicated and any text that would appear in the actual layout over 12 point should be written out so that we can see what does that type look like. Is it thick and chunky? Is it thin? Is it script? Um, give those details so that feedback will be relevant and effective. Roughs can be done by hand or on the computer and may be considered a whip or work in progress. A comp or a comprehensive layout is done to actual size and it is the finished file that you would present to a client or a vendor or that you would submit for grading. Thanks for watching Design Process by Example.